Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, or welcome to the channel. Today, I am actually going to pick up a new cat. He's a kitten, well, he's four months old, from a rescue center. I just thought that this, nope. this crazy boy, okay, bye, could have another friend, because I feel like Ted is really laid back and sleeps a lot, and Freddy's just wild. I think getting something like him, he'll really like, so I'm just on my way now. I've gotta go meet them at one o'clock. I've gotta leave now, so I've gotta be on my way. I have also moved house. Um, this is actually the first vlog in the house, but I'm definitely gonna be doing loads of woodwork, so uh, I've gotta make a dining table, some coffee tables, some side tables, but I still gotta get all the tools for that, and I don't know when I'm gonna do it yet, but there'll be vlogs coming up. But yeah, the move was, oh, it was really stressful. Moving is stressful. You don't realize how much stuff you have, and like in such a short amount of time to move as well. Uh, but yeah, I'm excited, so let's go. Just arrived, I'm just waiting for the lady to come out. Um, but yeah, I got the carrier. I won't be able to record inside just because it's private, so I'll catch you on the outside. And here he is. You're scared, aren't you, baby? His name's Duke, but I don't know if I want to change it. I don't want to scare him too much. This is a bit scary for him. But I'll go with some food. Um, hopefully he'll come out. It's okay. Very scared, baby. It's okay. He's extremely scared. I've set up his little bed for him. Um, he did hiss at me a little bit. Apparently what had happened to him was they'd taken him from a woman who had him, his three other siblings and his mum. She kept them in a cage, quite a small cage, covered in feces. There wasn't like any food or water. Probably had no socialization. Um, which is really sad. I'm hoping and I'm thinking it'll just take time for him to settle in. Um, he's just really scared. I gave him a bit of a treat because I know that bonding with food is really good, especially if it tastes nice. Uh, but yeah, I just want him to get used to me. Oh, he's letting me stroke him now, he's not so scared. But he's tiny, he's four months old. Okay, he likes it when I rub his eye. But he's, oh, he's just left his mum, his siblings. It's a new place, it's scary. But it'll just take a bit of time, probably more than like Freddy or Ted. They seem to be really socialized, but well, I had Freddy from five weeks, so. I suppose I socialized him. Um, but yeah, Ted. Ted was fine. Ted's just that kind of cat. He's got that personality. But yeah, his name is Duke. I think I might change his name. I don't know. Calling the cat Duke. Duke? Duke? I don't know yet. But maybe you guys can help me name him. He's a silver tabby. He's got a bit of brown on his face. I was thinking about calling him Chance. Chance? Because I'm giving him a second chance. Yeah, I might call him Chance. Chance. That's nice. Do you like Chance? So it's the next morning, um, Chance, he is doing okay, um, not the best, keeps hissing at me, he's hiding away. Uh, I changed, because basically he was able to have this whole room, but now I've changed it to what I initially had Freddy and Ted in. So I've just set up this little tent for him, he's actually hiding around the side. I feel really sorry for him, he came from his mum, he came from his siblings. It's all new, it's new smells. Oh, just wish I could help him. I spoke to the centre where I got him from and they just said, you know, just to persevere with him and he'll come around soon. Not that I want to give him back, so I'd never, <laughs> I'd never do that. I just wondered what I can do to help him more, settle him more. I bought some, um, it's called uh, Feliway. Feliway. I used it for Bella when I had Bella back in England um, to help her get used to Rex, my other cat. And it kind of worked, but this one's a spray and I've just sprayed it on all his bedding. It's meant to help them relax, you know, calm their nerves. I don't know how, oof. I don't know if it will work with him, but we'll see. But no, I just feel so bad for him. There's just so many animals that are in need of you know, rescuing and adopting. This place that I went to, the foster woman, oh, there was tons, she had loads of cats, loads of kittens. Oh, it's so sad she helps with the rescue, you know, take them in and foster them. It's just that this is why I want to be able to have a rescue farm, you know, a sanctuary where they can come and they can just live and, you know, they don't have to worry about being transferred to new homes. They can just come and relax and find a place at my place. If you guys are in my stream, then you'll know that that is my ultimate goal to be able to do that one day. Like from bunnies, to birds, to pigs, to sheep, cats, dogs, horses, donkey, whatever. You name it, I'll rescue it. But yeah, that's the plan. I'm just waiting for the girl that I live with to come back and then we're gonna sit with him again and just, you know, try and play with him a little bit. Ted's been really good with him. 
brought Ted in. Freddie's been hissing at him, so I just took Freddie out. He's not very good, he's a bit protective of me, I think. It's my own fault, because I've, I've babied him from when he was a baby, five weeks old. But yeah, I'll try and record some of that. I'll, um, you know, show him sitting in her lap and then my lap as well, just see how he goes on. Okay, so. This is now Friday. I pick Chase up on Tuesday. It's been a while to get him used to me. He's still not used to me. He's still very scared. Um, but he's playing with the cats. He loves the cats. He loves Teddy and Freddy. But now we've ventured from the spare room into my bedroom and he's hiding under the bed. So I've had to move his litter tray in here, his food, and my room is an absolute mess. Oh my God. I can't even vacuum it because it's going to get scared. Because <laughs> I left the door open for him one night for him to just venture out and around with the cats because he just kept crying and crying. I couldn't sleep. The other night I went to bed at 7.30 a.m. I know, 7.30 a.m. I know. It, no, I can't do that. So yeah, the plan was let him out. Anyway, the next day I couldn't find him and I found him under the bed. <laughs> now that's his spot. I'll try and lure him out with a treat if I can. He only really comes out if Teddy and Fred are here. Boys, oh my boys. Hi, Freddy. I'm gonna go Teddy Bear. Lovely boy. Oh, look at his big bushy tail. <laughs> You're my good boy, I'm a lovely baby. My lovely baby. Looks a scratch. And there's also, I don't know if I told you, there's two cats outside, so now I feed them. I don't know if they're stray or not. The life of Fred. The life of Fred. <laughs> oh, <laughs> good at little baby. Watch my baby. I'm a little baby. I'm a little baby. I'm a little tubby. <laughs> it's not fat, it's just big boned. That's your bone, isn't it? I know it feels like squidgy, but it's your bone, I know. Don't listen to them. Don't listen to what they say. <laughs> I'm just gonna make a coffee and crumpet. <laughs> a coffee and crumpet. Mm. <laughs> As I start my day, and I've got a lot of content to do today. So that should start me up. I forgot that I froze them. Oh, how do I get this apart? Oh no. <laughs> I just, <laughs> it's stuck. <laughs> right, this is the plan. I'm just gonna put it on heat and hopefully, <laughs> It would just, <laughs> I don't know, defrost or something. Anyway, I'll just make my coffee whilst I wait for that. I got these really cute mugs from Kmart. Um, they're like the insulated wall mug, double double wall, I don't know, double glass mug. Yeah, it's really good because um, it doesn't make your coffee hot on the outside, like to hold it, but it's still warm on the inside and it looks nice. a spoon of honey. Okay, crumpets. Still frozen. Should I put in the microwave? Start. I don't know. One care about no. Lunch. Defrost. Defrost. Yep. Alright. Nice. Bruh. So hard in one hand. And he's so cute. Oh, he's so cute. He's like a silver tabby, and then he's got this brown on him. Come here. Chase, chase. Oh, little baby. Chase. Good boy. Good baby. This is my situation with the carpet at the moment. Whilst the cat is under the bed, I'm having to from his litter tray from the bathroom come all the way into here. They're messy. I'm just brushing it. I'm just brushing it. And this is sweetie. Hi. Hi. I don't know if she, oh, come here. 
Come here. Let me get a video. She's so sweet. Hi. Hi. Good. Oh, little girl. I don't know if she's stray or not. I'm not sure. She seems. She was really scared of me for like oh, since I've been here about two weeks now. And she only just came up to me the other day. She's so lovely. <laughs> The camera. I called her a she because I'm sure she, it's a she. I don't know if anyone can tell me. Is that a girl? I think that's a girl. Sorry, just putting. Yeah, it's a girl. It's a girl. She's so lovely. Oh, you lovely girl. It doesn't matter if she's stray or not. I don't know. I'll just feed her anyway. <laughs> I went to the shops and I bought Chase a little cat tower that I can have in the bedroom. Um, I bought them some new litter because it's just a mess and it's like sand. It just goes everywhere. So let's put it together. We haven't got the star of the show. Are you going to make some dinner. I'm going to do that pasta. Uh, it's mascarpone, tomato, pesto, pasta, and prawns and garlic bread. Really good. Chopped up some garlic, prawns, pasta. I'll do my sauce in here, then I'll put prawns in. But I'm just going to go and feed chase my nephew called me today and he's like hannah if you get a cat can you call him felix so now i'm wondering whether to change his name to felix but i've been calling him chase and he knows chase but i feel bad for my nephew chase the food come on good boy come on chase eat okay let me think I'm going to stray across his eating. My hands smell like garlic though. Good baby, good boy, good boy. Oh no, it's okay, just eat. It's fine. It's okay, just eat. No, don't. Just let him eat. What a lovely Freddy. I just gave him a lot of food because I'm going to be streaming soon and I'll see to him. Obviously, I'll come out and see him, but it's good that he just fills up a little bit now and then he can go back to sleep and then we'll probably play when I finish stream at like 2 a.m. We play till like 4 a.m. <laughs> I feel like I'm so tired, like a mum. <laughs> no, but he's been a lot more hard work than any other cat that I've ever had. Oh, I don't know what he went through as, as a kitten. I'm not, I don't know, but he's really scared of humans. He doesn't mind loud noises. He's okay with that. Still won't put the vacuum on though. But yeah, he loves cats. I think he depends on Freddy and Ted for his confidence and they're really good i'm so glad that they like him freddie was a bit standoffish like hissing at him but yeah they're good now ted was really good I'm gonna quickly get change for stream whilst it's cooking. Anyway guys, I'm gonna stream now, so that is the end of the vlog. I hope you have enjoyed it. Meet and Chase, I'm sure you'll see him a lot more in the future vlogs, and you'll see him in the streams as well. The cat's always around me in streams. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you soon for more. Love you, bye. Love you, bye.